So saying like coming up, like, did you have any OGs or like big homies or any uncles or cousins, anybody that you looked up to that like influenced you into wanting to be a rapper or somebody that you looked up to, basically? As a rapper? Yeah. Like what influenced you to want to be a like, rapper? Music period, my fr the first song I, I memorized from the head and I loved it. And I wanted to date my man's cousin. Mm -hmm. This kid's like on some flirt shit, like four or five years old. And that was like, um, But I heard the song when I was about three. Uh, um, Bone Thugs and Harmony. It's the thuggish rug is bone. Okay, okay. That was a nice song. Everybody loved that. That was a slapper for sure. Especially yeah. throughout the 90s all the way to the early 2000s. That shit right there, though. That's my first song. I want, I want to do a, a sample to that bitch. Oh, yeah. You feel me? I ain't heard nobody on that shit chat. Yep. All right, we're moving along, moving along. Oh, uh, I can't forget Big Hurt, too, man. Okay. Big, big snap. I'm all about bars. I started rapping on seven. Oh, like, yeah. Writing my own lyrics and shit. Oh, oh yeah. Shit. Shout out yeah. to Big Hurt, man, too. Oh, me? rock bottom, man, for sure. Them Fuck guys man. are definitely Detroit legends, man. Hell yeah. We can't let that be unknown, man, with this interview. About, about fourth. About fourth and fifth grade, well, I say fourth grade, third grade. I think it was about nine, ten. I think it was fucking with um, Wayne first. Mm -hmm. I fucked with Wayne, and then a nigga got heavy on Fifty Cent because that nigga came out on some beastie shit for real. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Feel me? That was about fourth grade then. Okay, that's real. That's real. Bye.